Our meeting today has been very successful with the appointment of me as chairman, Priscilla Mabuki as treasurer, and Doji D as secretary. Woo, woo, woo. <coughs> However, I cannot disclose to you what we discussed today without the presence of the DO's representative, that is Chief Matano. We don't want that chief. I have a petition here for the committee to sign to get us a new chief. I've also spoken to the PC who has assured me of a replacement as soon as he gets that petition. It is for his own good. Now he doesn't have to worry much. He's careless and irresponsible. You can't have that kind of a chief to set to us that kind of an example. What is wrong with all of you? How can you make such a Samsons of Mr. Matano? He's not careless or irresponsible. He did not put his life at risk. It was an accident. Matano loves this town. And now because you think he's HIV positive, you said that he cannot be able to do his work as chief properly. And you've all presumed he has it because his wife is pregnant, so he must have the virus. And you all said that he cannot be able to do his job properly. So me. So me a time that this has happened since he's been married to me. Or any one time that he's been a bad example to anyone. Every single one of you is either infected or affected by the virus. It is a problem that affects our whole country. But instead of working together to support him, you're making him feel worse. Who said that people cannot live positively with HIV? Look at me. I can be president. But you don't have to treat me differently because I have the virus. We should love each other, support each other, not abandon those who supported us when they need us the most. Mrs. Matano, I love you. Matano must stay. 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 Matano must stay.